Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will show how to use guided access mode on an iPhone for kids or a single app. When you occasionally give your iPhone to a baby to watch videos, it's necessary to stop accessing other apps and settings. The guided access limits your device to use a single app. It's helpful to lock the iPhone touch screen and control which features are available per app. It is also helpful for students or anyone who wants to focus on a particular task without distractions. So, without wasting time, let's watch the video. Open the settings app on your iPhone. Then, scroll the screen and tap on accessibility. Now, again, scroll up and hit on the guided access. After that, turn on the toggle beside guided access. After enabling the guided access, tap on the passcode setting to set a new guided access passcode or skip this if you want to use your iPhone passcode as a guiding access passcode. Now, enter a passcode and re-enter to confirm it. In addition, you can turn on the Face ID toggle and double click the side button to end guided access with Face ID. The next setting is Time Limits. Tap on it, and two options are available, one sound and the second speak. It will play a sound and have the remaining guided access time spoken before time ends. The next option is the accessibility shortcut. When you enable it and triple click the side button during the guiding access session, accessibility shortcut settings will display. After that, the last is display auto lock. It used to set how long it takes your iPhone to lock during the guiding access session automatically. So, open the app that you want to use. For example, I will open the YouTube app. First, triple click the side sleep button of your iPhone and home button on home button iPhone. So, your iPhone screen will show the Accessibility Shortcuts menu. Scroll up and tap Guided Access. Next, tap on Options. There are different setting options available. For example, I want to use the volume button while playing a video on a YouTube app. So, tap on the toggle button to enable it, if you want to allow to use volume button then disable the toggle. Here, I am turning on the toggle beside the volume buttons. Then, tap on the Done button. Next, tap the Start button and enter the passcode for Guided Access Mode. Then, enter the passcode again to confirm. I can use the volume buttons now. You can customize other options, such as side buttons, motion, keyboards, touch, and time limits. Suppose you want to access motion, triple tap the side sleep button, and enter the passcode. Then tap Options, and turn on the toggle beside Motion. Here, make sure that the touch access is disabled when your device is in your baby's hand. Tap on the Resume option. It is easy to access the Motion on a single app. To end the Guided Access mode, triple click the side Sleep Screen button and tap on Guided Access. Your iPhone will show the Resume and End option at the top. So. Tap on the end option to exit the guided access mode. Thanks for watching. Ask your queries in the comment box. Be sure to like and subscribe to our channel for more tips and tricks videos.